Hi there and welcome to another Singing Teacher Reacts video. My name is Peter Vox and I am the Director and Principal Teacher at Vox Singing Academy and I have been since 1993. Before we start, if we could be of any help to you or any singers that you know, we would be absolutely honoured. And if you would like to join the Vox Singing Academy family, we are selling franchises throughout Australasia. Again, check out the links below for more info. If you get any value from this video at all, please give it a like, thumbs up, click like and subscribe to keep up with other great videos as well too. If you want me to react to a video of your choice, put it in the comments. If I get enough people wanting a particular video or artist, I will do a video. Now, without any further ado, I am going to react to Carrie Underwood, Ace of Spades in Nashville. Now, I stumbled across this video. Now, Carrie Underwood to me was always a country artist that did amazing country songs with an amazing voice and, and, and a very, very good range. I always thought that she was exceptional doing that. I've got one of her Christmas albums and she is phenomenal on this Christmas album as well too. Um, but yeah, she is a very, very talented person. Now, I don't normally do react videos for myself. I stumbled across this video, and it's Carrie Underwood doing Ace of Spades, which is a Motorhead song. Check out the original version. I'll put a link in the in the uh, in the description here. Live in Nashville. Now I stumbled across this by accident. I was actually watching a Guns N' Roses switch switch hold of mine live with Carrie Underwood. I actually did a. Um, a react video to it. I will, if I remember, I'll put the link to that react video as well too. It's a phenomenal react video, so please watch it. It's great to hear Carrie Underwood and Axel's voice and the comparison between the two voices. You'll learn a lot from that video, so check it out. I hope I remember to put the links in below. I will, as soon as I finish this, I'll write it down to put links in below for the two, the original Ace of Spades uh, by Motorhead and the link to our react video. So, without any further ado, I'm going to react to a very heavy song by an artist that I thought was just a country artist, uh, but she is going to rock this. I only watched about 30 seconds of it, and I said, I need to stop watching this so that I can watch it in its entirety and give you my, abs my absolute phenomenal reaction with it. So I only watched about 20 to 30 seconds when I first seen it, so I've never seen it all the way through, promise. But let's uh, let's watch it all the way through. It's a it's a banger. It only goes for two and a half minutes. Just 
I thoroughly, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed that. That was absolutely fantastic. Um, I like to know what the keyboard player was playing during that. I I'm, I'm suppose he was just playing some some ambient chords just to uh, just to thicken it up. There was three guitars. I think she had three guitars going there up on stage, um, and one bass player. The backing vocalist was uh, was doing nothing. Now, I really love the version. Uh, this was great. The band didn't hold back. It was heavy. I thought the bass was a little bit sort of pulled back. I know Lemmy really sort of strums that bass, and it's very Motorhead's very bass driven. Um, I thought the bass was pulled a little bit back, um, but I thought that the song was fantastic. I thought her vocal performance was exceptional. She was just balls out the whole time, and, and it was really great. She was a bit gritty. She wasn't using any light techniques or crying techniques. It was all just all pure voice, and, and she was giving it to it. So she obviously has quite a lot of um, stamina in her voice, training in her voice to be able to pull this off, plus also do the other clean vocals and the higher cries and the amazing range that Carrie Underwood has, and we know that she delivers particularly live. So a couple of things. It was excellent. High energy. And if you're going to sing a song like this, a rock song, you've got to move around like Carrie Underwood. So do that. Just don't stand static because you're not going to be able to express the emotion in the song that this song like, a song like this needs. So if you're doing rock songs or up-tempo songs, do what Carrie's doing and move around and get some energy. Do some jumping jacks. You just can't stand there and deliver. I know everyone, the Motorhead guy, plays bass, but he's rocking out as well too when he's doing it. So he's got the whole thing going. So that's the first thing. Her mic technique is amazing. She was sort of bending over a little bit, but I just think that was like the theatrics of it. I think she was doing this pretty easy. This is probably middle range for Carrie Underwood. Uh, her mic technique was great. She sort of had that microphone technique like nearly Axl Rose during the solo. She was, she was going around nearly doing the Axl Rose thing. So she's picked up a couple of points, a stage presentation things from Axl Rose there. Um, I thought it was great. I really loved the way that she was phrasing and she changed it up like, it's all a game to me. She was doing that instead of, it's all a game to me. So the way that she was mixing up and having her fun with it, and also when she sung that, the whole band kicked it, da 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 So I thought it was super dynamic and super punchy, and I loved it. One big, huge, massive, big takeaway that I have to sort of basically say with this song is it was the first time that I've heard the song and I understood every single word from start to finish. There were some words in there, and I, I know Ace of Spades by Motorhead, and I didn't know that that was the lyric. Uh, so thank you, Carrie Underwood, for um, amazing pronunciation, amazing diction. Uh, I love her phrasing how she was slowing things down and emphasizing words and punching words. Um, the, 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 the motorhead version is more so just balls to the walls. Um, if you like to gamble, I'll tell you I'm the man. And she was doing it. Like that, but phrasing it. If you like to gamble, I tell you I'm the man. You win some, lose some, it's all the game to me. So she was really emphasizing, particularly the last words, and, and the pronunciation was great. So I took a lot away from this. And again, I'll put the link into the original version so you can see the difference in, in what Carrie's doing and what Motorhead's doing. Now, I'm not taking any, anything away from Motorhead. This song is an amazing song by Motorhead. It's really nearly in the invention of real hard rock and heavy metal. Um, and, and Lemmy's got a very husky voice, and that's what he's renowned for. Um, and just to stand and deliver and just to, just to give it to it. So again, nothing and no disrespect against Lemmy Kilmer. He's an absolute legend of, of music and, and rock and roll. And a lot of people are inspired by him, including Carrie Underwood. And I'm surprised uh, about that, that she's doing this because it's, it's a great song. It's a heavy song. Um, but uh, fantastic. I really enjoyed this. And, and uh, I've never seen Carrie Underwood live, but I would definitely go and see her. Her band looks super tight. Looks. Sounds super tight. <laughs> um, and it looks like she's got some amazing musicians with her great stage great backdrops. Um, so yeah, excellent performance. I can't fault it at all. 
Her pitch was amazing. Microphone technique was amazing. Her breathing was great. She was stopping and pausing in, in all the right places. Um, her presentation, her phrasing, it was excellent. So I've given a lot away in a very short video here. So take that away. Apply it to your more hard rock songs, particularly the girls. Girls, if you're looking and you're doing some ballads, you're looking to do something more rock, you'll learn a lot off this Carrie Underwood uh, version in this song here because Carrie Underwood can also sing ballads amazingly as well too. So she's not just a one-trick pony. She can sing in lots of different styles and lots of different ranges, and she's very skilled, and she's had, by the sounds of her voice, a lot of, um, a lot of singing lessons because she has a great technique. If you've got anything from this video at all, please give us a like and a thumbs up. Please click like and subscribe and share. If you or anyone that you know needs singing lessons, please check out the links below. We give singing lessons all around the world online and also in Melbourne, Australia with numerous teachers, males and females. If you want to become and join uh, part of the Vox family, we are also selling franchises throughout Australasia. Again, check out the links below for more info. That wraps it up for another Singing Teacher Reacts video. Please live each day as if it's your last. Be good to everyone and peace and much love until the uh, next <laughs> until the next react video. Bye bye.